Well, back and Tiff is just kicking my butt. I found a void there and I can't wait to dig in. It may be that groundhog hole. And that groundhog is a bottle digger, I know. <laughs> I proved that last week. Yeah. Tiff's got a bottle. Let's find out what it is. Sutherland, seven Sutherland sisters. There you go, Sutherland sisters. Trademark colorator. Trademark, there's a colorator. Southern, what is their names? Suther, Sutherland sisters. Sutherland there's a sisters. seven in the middle. That's a first for us. Hold that at the hang up there. Oh, yeah, that's first for us. It's tear braids. It's a, it's a deer jerk. It's dirt a crier. Dirt. It's a crier, but look at that. There it is. Sutherland Sisters Trademark Colorator. Yeah, but we can cut that. that that's first for out. us. That'll Good job, cool. baby. Yeah. That's first for us. Hey, everybody. We're back again. Um, down here in this same hole again, the same place. Uh, Tiff's been just kicking my butt. So we got down here, had me a Ned fall out right here. Um, well, that's pretty cool. Wow. Whitmore Brothers out of Boston, French gloss. That's a first. Mm -hmm. Dude, don't turn it on. <clears throat> Take it on. Look at there, Whitmore Brothers, right? Whitmore, yep. Boston. Yep, very nice. And then French gloss. <laughs> early, early machine made, early machine made bottle. Very cool. That's pretty neat. That's the first one for us. Cool. Good job. See you soon. <laughs> hey, everybody. We're back again. Um, pulled this rib bone on <laughs> Just kidding. So, this just fell out of the bank right here. So, it just um, got me a clay pipe. Just fell out of the bank. Booyah! That's a good one there. Check that out. Little ribs. That's and everything. pretty. Prettiest That's one I've cool seen one. yet. I wonder if it's one of them ones from Staunton, Virginia, because it seems like most of the pipes we find around here, the clay ones, are from Staunton, Virginia. We'll to research it. Yeah, we'll research it and find out what that dirt We'll be able to find it. I mean, they're online there. It's pretty cool. And uh, so, uh, here we go. <laughs> Pop out a <of> sailor, man. <laughs> doot, doot. See you guys. Hey, everybody. I was working this bottle out of here, which ended up being broke, and got me a marble. Got me a clay marble in the hole. There it is. Tells you what age we're still in in this dump right here. Good deal. Pretty cool. Right over. Hey, everybody. I don't like filming broken glass. Them criers all the time. But you got to see this one. Sharpen down. Baltimore, Maryland. And check it out. Look it down on the top of it there. And it was a triangle front with a rounded back on it. Mm -hmm. Poison from Baltimore. The only machine made. Nice people. crier. <laughs> <laughs> See, See you ya. back. Over here scratching beside Tiff. C.H. Holtzman, Cumberland, Maryland. Good job. There's our local druggist <laughs> for the day. You see it? Yep. C.H. Holtzman, Cumberland, yep. Maryland. Very cool. <laughs> hey, everybody. Check this thing out. I have no idea what this is. First of all, got us a, uh, a Gilbert Brothers and Company out of Baltimore, Crier. Nice flask there. Very nice. Real nice one there. Just big old champagne bottle. I want to show everyone the bottom on that thing. That's cool. It's a hawk titty there, isn't it? Look at that. And then got this for Tiff with that there. There's our broken bromos and our sharpened mm -hmm. down poison. But check this thing out. This thing came out. I mean, is that like what you cook something on, or is that like, is that? Tell me in the comments what that is. I don't know whether it's a serving tray. It's cast iron. We'll get it cleaned up and see if there's any, any markings on it. It looks like there might be writing on the bottom. Boy, it's pretty old pitted though. But um, yeah, I mean, there's what cast iron looks like after it's been in the ground for 125 years. But, Very cool. Um, it's whole. We're going to clean that thing up, see what it looks like, what we got there. But um, Tiff's going to go to church, and um, I'll take over and find a couple more cool things before I go to the house and start washing bottles. So happy Sunday to you, and we'll see you here soon. Okay, guys, my time is coming to a close. I'm getting ready to head out of here, heading to church. But I wanted to show you, it's not whole, but I got me a pipe too. Woohoo! Three marbles, a button, a part of a pipe. We're doing pretty good. Have a great Sunday.
Back at you. And then, just like that, two pulls later, there are clay marble. Back in that time still. All right, we talk to you soon. Hey everybody. Usually we pull these terracotta things all the time. This is probably about the coolest one I think I've ever pulled. And I don't know, you guys, look like a little Quaker or kid. You know what? I don't know what's going on here with this thing. Got a little cool hat on right there and a little overcoat. This thing's complete, man. I don't know what this is. We're going to find out. But, um, yeah, it's terracotta and it's hollow and check it out. That is pretty wild, Ray. I guess those are night, night clothes, maybe? I don't know. Someone's gonna tell me. Oh, wow. It says something on it. Bowman. It says Bowman. What in the world goes in there? What that is? If anyone knows what that is, let me know. It ain't no pipe or nothing, but wow, man, that says Bowman on Bowman's my grandparents' name. That's pretty freaking awesome right there. All right. Hey, we'll see you. Hey, everyone. Check this little bottle out I just got. Ooh. Little thing on the bottom, little design. Look at that thing. It's not. Pretty cool looking, huh? I don't know what that is. Ink or... I don't know. If you know what that is, say something in the comments below. I'm sure it clean up. It's going to be per beautiful. All right. Just about ready to do the roundup. Get out of here. See you soon. Hey, everybody. Tonight we do a little bit different on cleanup just because I just want to do it because we found something really special today and um, they need the video for it. So we're going to do a video cleanup. So remember today when we were digging, we got this here French gloss, um, Whitmore Boston French gloss. That's a pretty cool bottle right there that we got. Um, this blue one is just, we just can't even, just don't even, I can't even tell you on video how pretty that blue bottle is right there. They all got the slug plate, the blank slug plates on them there. All three of them are really pretty. Um, the Great Atlantic Pacific Tea Company. That's a really cool one right there. Um, the Aqua Cumberland Brewing. That's a cool one there. Uh, here's the Cumberland Brewing that we find all the time right there. These are all ladies leg look ones here's this pluto water the top of that's really cool i want to show you the top of that one right there but um yeah and then this one here that we got today how in the world did this get into cumberland maryland you know this is from atlantic city the drug shop you'll have to bell and heim bell mine bell heim, but yeah there's nothing wrong with that ball it's ribbed on the back side of it right there um, one way we got today, it was pretty cool. Um, use Dill's family extracts. And then there's another one here that says, um, United, or I don't even know what this one. United. Can't tell. I have to get Tiff to help me with that one. But um, anyway, that's where we're at with this. And I just wanted to do, we got our marbles today. We got our buttons. This stopper right here is pretty cool. It says lean and parents on it. That pipe right there is just freaking awesome right there. I mean, I wish it was hold. That's like the Sherlock Holmes pipe. That's clay when like we want to have inside. But here's the prize for today. This right here says Bowman and Company. And this is supposed to be a little garden gnome boy. From everything we can find on this, these were uh, produced in Germany, and uh, they were put into Cracker Jack boxes, and they were sold. And that little terracotta statue right there is going to catch you off guard, because, um, let me see if I know how to do this. I can't turn it around, but uh, listen to this. 
it's a whistle. That's what that is right there. That's a hundred year old, 125 year old Cracker Jack box prize made in Germany. I, I don't know how to turn the camera around on video. Dog seems to like it. Isn't that cool? All right, listen. I'm going to get off here. Just want to show you our four finds for today. Tiff and I found. Um, and uh, we'll talk to you. Hey, that there's got this one here. Has that Freedom Cross on. I wanted to show you that right there. That had the Freedom Cross on. And then this one here has the emblem on it for the Consolidated Fruit Marketers up there. Those are really cool seals to find. This right here is pipe and off of a old clay pipe that's a pipe end that's a toothbrush this is a pipe end right here made out of bakelite that would have been a pipe end right there as well going into one of them air clay pipes but uh all right we'll see you All right, guys, it's Sunday, July 21st, 2024. We're out here at the Shoops Grove Bottle Show. Me and brother man David, bright and early, setting up his table for the day. You can see a lot of people's already left from yesterday. There are maybe about a dozen or so tables still set up. We'll walk around and look at. But here's one of the ones he got from the auction yesterday. We were looking at it, bird bitters. 
So I got to reading about it and check it out, guys. It's actually, it says a specific for the restoration of song. An excellent treatment for nearly all the diseases of caged birds. Philadelphia Bird Food Company. Did you ever know there was such a thing, guys? Alcohol, 28%. 28% for the birds, baby. 15 drops. Carry birds through the impulting season without loss of song. Isn't that crazy? I actually had a bitters for your freaking pet bird. There's the original box leftover that came in. I mean, that's just wild. Never knew anything about that bottle, guys. And if you were to dig it without the label, you can see there is no indicator of what it was at all. Except for the label. Man, that's awesome, though. That's really, really cool. And all the other neat labeled bitters. The root bitters. Got the shaker wine. Look at that beautiful hawk wine with the original label. The Hostetters, the Lashes, the Roxana, Kentucky Tonic, Crowder, Laxo. Just some real cool stuff. Mandrake. Here's a Nervine bitters. Look at the bottle that it's on. A Lydia Pinkham's. Lydia Pinkham's Medicine. <laughs> Dr. Benz's Appetite Bitters. That's awesome stuff. Heck yeah, guys. See you back. Guys, we're at Shoots Grove. Everybody's packing up. I've been uh, talking to brother man David for a while. I'm gonna help him get everything packed up. Got some incredible stuff for tonight's auction. Trav's been down catching crayfish as always. He's got two containers of them. Look, there's big ones. And small ones. And small ones. Good golly, Chad. Look at all of them in there. That's wild, buddy. I need more big ones. All right. You gotta go let him go. Nope. I gotta go find your mama, and we might be staying at David's house tonight. Nope. Yeah. All right, I'll see you guys right back. guys see anything that you would like to have let me know the tire crate from Hanover PA full of hutches big old thing of stoppers two dollars each some really nice dinnerware gravy bolt boats we got mason jars. We got some really nice ink wells with the beautiful stands. Got some carnival glass. Some really neat matchbook holders. Jars of marbles. Whiskies. Really nice stoneware inhaler. Some beautiful ornate fancy whiskies the canners there's a really nice internal threaded weeks and potter out of boston a 
you guys see anything you'd like to have or get a closer look at let me know some beautiful patent whiskeys iron pawnel dietville glass works some cut straight side coca-colas huntington west virginia lexington kentucky arrow coke let me know guys as long as you're willing to pay shipping we can do paypal venmo cash app credit cards there's a really nice patented pepper sauce 1874 look at that 1874 beautiful teal pepper some real nice labeled whiskeys and gins anything you guys see you want let me know i'm here for a couple hours this is my brother man david's table so we can make it happen some nice historicals check out these awesome boyd paperweights from the mason jar company anything you guys see that you want to closer look at or would like to purchase let me know just doing a quick little video for you help my brother man david out Some real nice midget masons with the original lug lids. Super nice and whittled up. Urine specimen cup. Just some real neat stuff, guys. There's some inks. Some real nice funnel inks. Spool inks, square inks, master ink there poisons nutcracker powder flask there's some really nice pumpkin seed there cool horseshoe flask mucilages even got some fossils some ammonite fossils civil war period flask still wrapped up nice barrel barrel mustard and then one more table guys we got the labeled the labeled bitters if anybody's interested now is the time hit us up it's all for sale you want to see anything closer up or any information on it let me know just all kinds of nice stuff some nice roads snap case roads or hinge mold whatever you want to call them some nice stuff in here guys Nice midget crown mason. A couple more midgets, a couple masons, patents, ball jars. Yeah, guys, let me know. See anything you like.
a sweet ride, man.